A local man woke up in the middle of the night at around 3.30 in the morning because he heard spooky noises. He went to investigate, and this is what he found. Take a look. It is truly disturbing. All right, everybody, forgive me for if it seems a little bit janky today. I have to hold the camera just because of how big he is. Now, originally, I was going to put Nightcrawler in my room. So this is, in fact, the Nightcrawler review. Um, but he's just too, he's too wide. But this thing is scary. Look at the face. Okay. He might trigger because he's on. So when I walk in front of him, he might, he might go off. Um, but here he is. Pretty spooky. But look at that face. Like the glowing eyes, the weird teeth, like the, the malformed like face with like the weird skull nose and like the, like the demon kind of screaming mouth. But yeah, he's pretty cool. My uh, landlord actually set him up for me and neglected to let me help, but he's still pretty cool. And it's so nice for my landlord to do for me, but there he is. He's going to go off again. Really loud mechanical noises. Oh, his hair is in, his still tied up, so I might have to untie that. Looks like he's got like a weird braid or something. But oh, pretty cool. His fingers are as, really cool as well. Like they're kind of like bony claws. Um, and, and then there's the back. He's really not much to him. Um, but there he's got like the kind of weird garb all over him. He's gonna. Yeah, there's the box over there. You can see the box. But this is so scary. Like, just imagine this guy. Like, imagine he was, like, really alive, like a real creature. And he got into your house somehow or something, like, through the back porch or something. And then started chasing you through your house in the middle of the night at, like, 3 a.m. That'd be so fucking scary. Like, <laughs> Nightcrawler 3 a.m. challenge, everybody, right? But, yeah, I'm going to turn him off because I don't want him to deactivate so many times that he breaks. Because this was expensive. But he's still really cool. The details on it are nice. Um, I nice a simple build, if you can call it that. Um, because the mechanics in it, like the actual animatronic part of it, is pretty complicated. That's why I got my uh, landlord to kind of do it for me. Because um, he's pretty complicated. Like so many bars, so many mechanics, so many mechanisms, all that kind of stuff. But the payoff is really worth it. He's a cool, creepy looking animatronic for Halloween. And yeah, I love him. Now, I know I was going to get Monty, but I, I didn't expect Monty to be so large. I expected him to be Monty, uh, to be a Sam from Trick or Treat size when they made that animatronic for that character. Um, so he was huge, and I didn't expect him to be so expensive. Um, so we got Nightcrawler here instead, and i got to say, he's still pretty cool and pretty scary. All right, here we are closer, taking a look at like his hair, like it's real hair. Or not real hair, but like real hair strands. Um, the face is horrifying. And I like how when the lights aren't turned on, they still have detail in the face. Like his eyes are like white with like weird veins going through them. Um, really scary. And then obviously he's got the pale face with like the uh, the weird kind of, you know, skull-like nose. And then trailing into the, the mutated teeth and the long screaming demonic face. But yeah, pretty cool. Uh, the uh, claw stuff that goes over him to look like tattered garb. Um, and then he's got his claws again, which I'm taking some more detail at. Like, like, look at the veins and, like, the detail on this. There's not much paint on it, but there's enough to just really bring it to life. And all the claws look like the same, even the back claws right there. Um, obviously, he's on this little thing here to keep him stable. Um, cause he jumps up really fast when he's turned on, but this guy is super cool. Like there's the box again. 
You can look at the box right there for the Nightcrawler. He's just super cool. Yeah, I love him. He's uh, definitely a pretty creepy character. And the detail that went into the face, the hands, and like the body of this thing. Now, the body doesn't really have a lot of detail because it's just some clothes put over put over like a metal frame but still it's a nice little animatronic and i got this on discount i don't know how much it was originally but i got this for 200 dollars. so not a bad price for a really awesome looking character and this guy is set to feature in the spirit halloween feature film so that'll be exciting i can't wait to see what his role in the film will be um but with that being said hope you guys enjoyed my look at the spirit halloween nightcrawler animatronic and with that being said have a great night Happy haunts, and I'll see you in the next frightening video.